This is a cool trick I actually learned from my kids about um, doing custom colors in Google Drawings. This also works in Google Slides. A lot of the drawing tips that I'll share are also applicable to when you're using the drawing tools in Slides. So I'm going to create something to have a shape and make a rectangle. Here's my rectangle and it default fills a certain color. If I go into my Paint Bucket tool, I can go down to Custom Color. Here you can use the code for the color. You can move particular colors around, change it darker if you want. But what is really cool, what I thought was amazing that I hadn't known before, was the fact that you can also edit the transparency when you are making your custom colors. So I'm going to change the transparency of this color so we can see it. Now I have a slightly transparent purple for my shape. Now when you create another shape, and if I want to change the color, I can go into my color again and you can see that my custom color, my slightly transparent purple, is there. If you hover over it, you can also see the RGB uh, colors for it if you ever want to recreate it in another presentation or drawing because these custom colors only stay with that particular file. But I just thought that was kind of cool and something that you might want to use. You can see that the overlap, you can see the transparency really works really well. And depending on what it is you're creating, this is something that's very handy.